Hey guys, we hope that you are ready for tonight. We're having prayer meeting and we're having Bible study. We're going to spend part of our time of study just praying for our caravan, our prayer caravan on Friday. And we are getting ourselves in our gear and we are ready to deliver what the will of the Lord is. But let's just get back to our devotional. Um, please keep in mind that Jesus said, it is finished. And I want to deal with the verb is because Jesus is on a cross nailed to uh, convicted thieves are, are being crucified with him. They're dying prematurely because it was they, they, it was their crimes, not their righteousness that brought them there. And Jesus stands in the midst of all of this and he's not saying it was completed or it will be completed. He stands and he says it is. He's standing in the moment recognizing, full recognition that the assignment he knew the assignment. He knew when the assignment was being accomplished. He was part and parcel of all of the sacrifices, whether it be making disciples, healing the sick, raising, raising the dead. He was part and parcel understanding this was it. And in the midst of it, he says, guys, I've reached the end of the road. This is my end. And sometimes we walk with people and, and we, we're, we're, they're mentoring us, they're pushing us so that we might excel and that we might grow. And what happens is they come to their end and we get so depressed and so, and so uh, melancholy that we think it's our end. But Jesus said to these guys, this is, this is my stock. But you will go forth into the world and make disciples. This is my stop, it's not yours. My assignment is completed. And he stands in that moment, appreciating that his assignment was over. The salvation of our souls was paid for. The, the, the uh, releasing of the Spirit of God was imminent. The resurrection is a three day away. But right now he stands and says, guys, I understand where I am. And it is finished. It is. It's, it's present. He knew where he was. The only way you can know where you are is if you're in tune with God, if you understand and hear his voice and know that he has set the boundaries and you know when he has, he is calling you to be completed and to end it. I hope you appreciate that God is definitely calling, setting you up so that you might finish the course. What did Paul say? He says, I've finished. I've finished my course. I've run the race. I've finished my course. And now it's laid up for me a place in heaven. I've finished my course. And now it's laid up for me. And I say to you, you're not finished. Don't hang up your boots as yet. You're not finished. The present demands more of you demands all of you. So why not engage, involve, sink yourself in, fully immerse yourself in the will of God. Let's not wait until it's too late to try to finish the rest of the assignment. We're finishing. We're in the moment, applying the grace and walking in the space that God would have prepared for us. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray your people will have a clear, very clear, appreciation of what you are doing in this hour in Jesus' name.